Hello everyone! Have you ever played a map that display the remaining lives? Today I will teach you Eggy Code tutorial how to display the user's remaining lives. First go to Workshop, open up Blank Map. Click Settings button, click Rule Settings. Make sure the code rules is open. Change Max Lives to 3. Click Features, click UI Editor. Click Text button, click Default Text. Enter text, type Current Lives. Enlarge the text font size. Click Image button, find a hard image. Enlarge the hard image. Then duplicate the hard image until there are three hard images. Click on the first hard image, click More, click Event. Type 0 in the event, hide the widget. Click on the second hard image. Type 1 in event, hide the widget. Click on the third hard image. Type 2 in event, hide the widget. Create death zone in this blank map. Click mechanisms button. Select a death zone in the logic. Then make a sign so you know it's the death zone. I added flame on there. Click Features, click Eggy Code. Click Event, select Initialize Game. Click Action, select Set Variable. Click Variable Column, add new variable. Type Life in the column. Select Life. Click Int Column, Type 3. Click Event, click Trigger Volume. Select Eggy Enters, Exit Specify Trigger Volume. Click Trigger Volume Event Column, Select Enter. Click Trigger Volume Column, Select Go to Scene Selection. Select Death Zone. Click Action, Select Send Custom Event. Click String Column, Enter Text Life Minus 1. Click Event. Click Common. Select Receive Custom Event. Click String Column. Enter Text Life Minus 1. Click Action. Select Set Variable. Click Variable Column. Select Life. Click End Column. Select Expression. Select Math. Select Int Operation. Click in column, select variable, select life. Click operator column, select minus. Click int column, type 1. Click control, select if, else. Click that column, select compare. Click any value column, select int. Click in column, select variable, select life. Click Int Column, Type 2. Click Action. Select Interface. Select Send Interface Event. Click String Column, Type 2. Click Any Value Column, Select Player. Click Player Column, Select Player 1. Select that row, Duplicate and Paste. Click to column, change it to 1. Click to column, change it to 1 again. Select that row, duplicate and paste. Click one column, change it to 0. Click one column, change it to 0 too. That's all for Eggy Code Tutorial how to display the user's remaining lives. Let's play test.
Thanks for watching.